Yo, what's good, people? This your boy, Authentic973. This your boy, The Path 57 on YouTube. Y'all already know I'm bringing y'all Madden 25. This is Ultimate Team. Bang. I'm doing a big 50-pack pro bundle. Let's jump right into it. As you see, we start off with some jerseys. <laughs> That's never a good sign. But I decided to buy uh, the 50 packs. Who we got? BJ Raji right there, a 78. I decided to buy a 50 pack bundle and bring y'all and bring bring these to y'all at 10 at a time because I didn't want the video to be like a half an hour. And I know you know sometimes I talk a lot and I ramble on and ramble ramble. So I decided to bring you guys. Excuse me. I decided to bring you guys 10 at a time. So. The video wouldn't be too. The video wouldn't be too long. Now let me talk about Ultimate Team. Y'all sit back, relax, enjoy the pack opening. We get something good, you know. We'll get into it. But y'all, who we got? Jamie Macklin, not bad, 79 overall. But let me talk about Ultimate Team. One thing I like about Ultimate Team, some of you guys might not like it. First of all, let me tell you something I don't like. First, I think the injuries on Ultimate Team is too high. I mean. People play. Oh my God! We got Righty White. Let's go. An 89 Righty White Elite card. That's how you start off a pack opening right there. That's what I'm talking about. That is what I'm talking about right there. And we got Reggie. Yo, this was a great pack. We got 79 Reggie Wayne, 79 Macklin, and an 89 Righty White. This is bananas right here. And like the second pack opening. This is why I like buying the bundles. But back to what I don't like about Ultimate Team. I think the players. Hold up. And we got a Leonard Hankinson. A 70. I think the players get hurt too frequently. So I think the injuries need to be turned down. Because they get hurt too easily on this joint. So that's one thing I don't like. But let me tell you what I do like. I actually like that it's harder to get an all 99 team. If I were to. I don't want to spoil the pack opening, but last year I did I did a big pack opening as well when Matt and 13 Matt and 13 came out, and um, I'm talking about oh who we got we got an 82 McFadden right there, and the first couple of packs I got if y'all didn't watch that go check them out go check out my old pack openings I always do these for all the games NCAA Matt and NBA 2K. And uh, I'm talking about I was getting legends and elite players and I mean my team before I even played a game I bought a pack and my team was like a 94 95 it was just crazy I had so many good players that I, I gave my man Ed Jones a Calvin Johnson I actually told him he couldn't play when we play he was not allowed to use uh, Calvin Johnson against me so I actually gave some of the players. I actually gave some of the players that I had doubles of away to like QJB, but not yeah QJB, Spade, uh, Jones, a few people. I even gave some away to subscribers. But I actually like how they got it now that you actually really have to play some games. You're gonna have to. We got a what's that? A 79 Reggie Bush. You see what I'm saying? Like this, Reggie Bush is a gold card and he's a 79. Now gold before. Last year probably could have been like an 89 or or 88 or something or maybe a 91, and you know the higher rated cards like a 99 and or 97 those were elite cards, the red joints those were the elite cards or the legendary cards or something like that. But I actually like how they got it now that it's harder to get your team good in a fast way even if you do buy packs because we was in a party last night my man Ed Jones bought some packs we got Jason Witten a 79 you already know that's my cowboy dude but I was in a party last night my man Jones bought some packs he was like yo I'm tight because I ain't really get shit and I actually like it like that you buy packs you know what I mean like I said last year you get legends and all type of craziness now they made it harder I'm a fan of that I want to know how you guys feel about that do y'all like that Oh, we got the muscle hamster. We got Doug Martin. Let's go. Oh, see, oh man, and it's you know I'm not getting bad players like 85, 80. Got a uh, 90 P Carroll. Like I'm not getting bad players. Like these players are solid, great. I don't want to say great. These they are solid, good players. Like above average players. So can't be mad at that. I mean, I put I don't played a few Ultimate Team games. I before I wanted to bring you guys a game. I actually want to get these packs out. Because before I even play the game, I opened these packs. So these, this is my team. Um, I know some of you guys don't agree with buying packs, but it is what it is. If you think I'm the only person on YouTube, and I only did a 
50 pack joint like other people on YouTube done did $400 I seen people do a $400 pack opening crazy but anyway that's neither here nor there uh, if you think I'm the only person opening packs I feel like you gotta open packs because you want to be able to compete that's how I feel and then with NCAA giving everybody a goddamn RG3 which I don't agree with anyway I think it should have been something else because if people want an RG3 they could have picked RG3 as the captain now everybody out there running the speed option all you need is a speed option playbook we got Golden Tate right there another set of 76 player but he a gold card and uh you want an RG3 you, you should have picked him as your captain I don't think Madden should have gave everybody a RG3 we got a collectible got some collectibles but I don't know like I want to know how you guys feel about ultimate team I know some of y'all done jumped out there in that water and got 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 in a few games in you know how did they turn out are you losing because people teams are better than yours or you are you losing from bad mistakes or are you winning are you kicking people ass and you didn't buy packs because some people I mean I lost the game in the first season and dude sent me a message. I should have put it in this video. But dude sent me a message and was like, uh, Bro, you shouldn't have lost to me. Your team is too good. We got Gerald McCoy, you're 76. You sh your team is too good. You should not have lost to me. You suck. I mean, my record right now was like 16 and... Uh, I want to say I'm 16 and 6. Or 17 and 6. Something like that. Um, we got Devin Hester, who I'll probably get a case spade the prospect because he a Miami fan. He actually had Devin Hester. He's a seven. He got good. Sp he got great speed, but I don't like his catch. But so I probably get that to my man case spade. But I, right now, you know, I'm a big Ultimate Team fan. I asked you guys earlier if you guys wanted me to. Uh, well, in uh, like two videos ago, I asked y'all, did y'all want me to bring back Ultimate Team on Monday Night Footballs before Monday Night Football come on? Some of y'all said yeah. Some of y'all say do it on Thursday. I still haven't decided how I'm going to do it. I'm not going to post a full game anymore. I used to post a full game. We got an 88 Joe Flacco. Um, I used to post a full game, but I'm not going to do that anymore because, you know, I don't think y'all I don't think y'all attention span is that long to sit here through a, another, a 40 minute video. I mean, it got it got OK views. And I know that some people like some people like full games. Cause they get to see like your mistakes they get to see everything and that, that's what i did last year last year my ultimate team record i think was 40 49 and 6 i had like some old crazy ultimate team record this year it seems like it's going to be a little harder because it you know it's, it's harder to get your team rated high so like i said i want to know you guys store on matt and ultimate team i'm going to do these pack openings by 10 so i got four more coming and um i'm trying to upload them back to back not the same day but like a day after one day after another but this your boy authentic 973 lapaz 57 i appreciate all y'all y'all know how i am my shit